Well, hi, I'm Paul, and this is Ask Me, <laughs> as Paul. Um, let's see what we got here in our list. Greg in New York City. Hey, Greg. Says, in-wall cables for stand-mounted loudspeakers, will this impede performance? Yeah, that's, that's an interesting question. So, Greg wants to know if you take your speaker cables and you put them in the wall so they're neat and tidy and your spouse doesn't jump up and down about these snake hoses laying on the floor, does that going to impede performance? No, I, I think it's a, a great way to go. In Music Room 1, we have our interconnects, in any case, a long 50-foot pair of AudioQuest that go up 50 feet into the walls, over the ceiling, and down into the back, or the front wall, I should say, and out, and doesn't affect it at all. Now, what you want to be careful about is getting speaker cables and interconnects too close to any kind of AC wiring. So you'd want to be careful doing that, but I, I don't think it's going to impede performance, and it sure as heck is going to improve relationships in the house and make for a, a pretty cool setup. That said, one thing I would caution, if you're like me and decide from time to time that you're going to change loudspeakers or you're going to change equipment, we all know that one set of cables that maybe works great for this pair of speakers and that power amplifier may not also work for another pair of speakers and another amplifier. So I wouldn't want to be in the position of swapping things around too much because you're going to be stuck with those cables unless you can do something like Smurf tubing. Do you, I don't know if you know what Smurf, I don't know what people call it. I call it Smurf tubing. Maybe our wizards can And I'll show you what Smurf tubing looks like if I can find something. Basically, it's flexible tubing. It happens to be blue, Smurf blue. It's flexible tubing that allows you to kind of stuff a cable through and put it in. Then if you need to change it, you can just pull it back out and stuff a new one through. So if you did do something, use something like that Smurf tubing uh, if, if you can. And I think that would be the only caveat that I would have other than keeping it away from any kind of AC power cables. If you do that, I don't think you have anything to worry about. Good question. Thanks for asking. Bye-bye.